As car theft surged all across the St. Louis region, the St. Charles County Prosecuting Attorney's Office says they are not going easy on car thieves. But there can be challenges when it comes to prosecuting certain cases. News 4's Gabriela Vidal is live in St. Charles County tonight, breaking down what some of those challenges are. Gabby. Yeah, Corey and Sam, prosecuting attorney Tim Lomar here in St. Charles County says one of these issues in prosecuting these types of crimes is the suspect's age. Now, the prosecuting attorney's office only handles cases for 18 and older, while the juvenile courts handle anything younger than that. And a lot of these people are winding up being juveniles that are being caught. Now, this week, one such case, the St. Charles uh, Auto Task Force handled Tuesday night, involved 18 and 19-year-old suspects. The prosecuting attorney says that at least one has been been uh, charged Aubrey LaShawn Anderson facing for the theft of two stolen vehicles out of a driveway in Wentzville and Anderson is also being accused of assaulting a St. Charles County police officer when Anderson who was found armed allegedly swung and punched the officer who was in the process of arresting him. Now prosecuting attorney Tim Lomar says that even though individuals in these cases may be young it is important to ensure that they are held accountable to prevent future crimes. We know this is an organized effort, and we know that uh, the people that are responsible for organizing, they send out the young kids because they know that the likelihood of them getting in big trouble is, is less significant than if uh, somebody's a little bit older. But it is tough because uh, a lot of times these people don't have a criminal record, and this might be the first step towards that. Uh, but our position has been and remains that we will be tough on these cases. We'll ask for high bonds, and ultimately when it comes time to adjudicate these things, we ask for mandatory prison time. Lomar says that two other suspects were involved in Tuesday night's uh, auto theft incident. Now, he says the prosecuting attorney's office is still looking to gather more information before issuing any charges. And another two suspects were arrested last overnight with, with regarding two other auto theft pursuits handled by the St. Charles County Ta auto, Ta Ta auto Task Force. Reporting live in St. Charles County, Gabrielle Vidal, News 4.